Is Boeing still a safe company? This is something more and more people are increasingly starting to question. Just in the last few months, we've seen the crashes of two brand new 737 MAX aircraft, its grounding across every country in the world, as well as Boeing being accused of rushing production of their 787s. And while granted these are unrelated incidents, the more these topics get thrown around and discussed, such as in the media or just in casual discourse, the more people start to wonder, are these incidents truly coincidental in their timing, or is there something with Boeing as a whole that we should be paying more attention to? Now I'd just like to preface this by saying I'm a big fan of Boeing, and I'm not making this video as opposition towards them, but rather out of a place of concern, as I'm sure many are, for the company's overall integrity and reputation. First, we have to ask ourselves, what kind of a company is Boeing? More specifically, what kind of a company is Boeing in relation to their direct rival Airbus? Because understanding this may allow us to start to uncover the driving force behind Boeing's decisions and thus problems. For the sake of accessibility, let's switch over to the situation with the 737 MAX. Boeing designed the aircraft to function as a direct competitor to Airbus's equivalent, the A320neo. As you probably know, this aircraft functions almost exactly as its predecessor, the A320, except that it has bigger engines. This means that little additional training is required and pilots are on their way flying the new aircraft. Now naturally, Boeing wanted to do the same, and quickly. They designed the 737 MAX, making various adjustments here and there, but the focus of the revamp was to increase the engine size. And so they did, except the one issue with the 737 is that it's significantly more lower to the ground than the A320. So they raised the engine up higher, but this compromised the ergonomics and caused the nose of the aircraft to pitch up higher than usual. To combat this, they created MCAS, and that's when all the problems started. Now more recently, Boeing has been accused of rushing production of their 787s. The New York Times has openly stated that the company is running a shoddy production at their North Charleston factory. Within this report were complaints from various employees, to which Boeing simply turned a blind eye and ignored, claiming they are not necessary to follow up on. Through reviewing hundreds of internal emails, corporate documents, federal papers, as well as interviewing more than a dozen current and former employees, they found a quote, culture that often valued production speed over quality. You see, this is where the problem lies. With the 737 MAX, they are in a rush to compete with the Airbus A320. With their 787s, they are in a rush to get them flying as soon as possible. And now, of course, they are in a rush to get the 737 MAX back into service. Boeing is constantly in a rush, and I think now, more than ever, it's starting to rear its ugly head and turn back at them. Boeing really needs to think about what is important to them. Is it production speed or quality? Because I'll be frank with you, as much as I like Boeing aircraft, I always felt that Airbus have a slight leg up in quality. And when was the last time you heard Airbus rushing production? You see, that is where I think Boeing falls short. They devote too much of their attention to getting planes out quickly that they in turn diminish their time to focus on quality. So back to the original question, is Boeing still a safe company? Well, as bad as this all sounds for them, the fact is that a few crashes and some problems with production will not dictate the safety of an entire company. Boeing is huge, and as such, they can take the hit financially. However, where they are more vulnerable is in their reputation. These last few months have revealed Boeing's mentality as a company, and unsurprisingly, have resulted in people starting to lose faith in them. So whilst Boeing still remains safe, and will only become safer after all this is over, it is their reputation that has become unsheltered. So anyway, what do you guys think of all of this? Am I totally off base with my assertions, or would you say you agree? Let me know in the comment section below. A bit more of a subjective video this time around, but I wanted to share my thoughts on what has been going on with Boeing, because it is quite a lot. As always, thanks for watching, and I will see you all very soon. I'm